Okay, good. I be- we believe we have uh, Lewis versus Dave next. Yeah, I, according to our schedule that I have here, it will be Dave versus Lewis next. And that, is, well, that was the final match in BMSC, wasn't it? That's right, yes. So oh, yeah. Uh, this will be a rematch of that. Much, much of an anticipated matchup here, so... Yeah, look, I did check the the BMSC head-to-heads. Lewis did win three of the four games. They're both very solid players. I mean, oh yeah, anything can happen here. I don't. We can't really make any predictions. There, yeah. there's been some good scrabble played by everybody today. Hopefully, USA will get some more wins. There's been some. There were. There's just been very good strategy played by the Brits so far, and. I mean, I think good words all around. It's just been a matter so far of who's gotten the better letters, and I think so far that's been the UK. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, we're awesome, aren't we? Us Brits. You guys are bringing out your best in this, I mean. Crushing. Well, we've got we've got uh, two national champions. So we've got the current national champion. Uh, in Phil Robertshaw. No, we don't. We don't have. Harshan is the. Sorry, uh, Dave's just messaged me. Um, so obviously Harshan is our national champion from two thousand and three. You know, probably the three of us being so young, we can't even remember what two thousand and three was like. Yeah. So. I mean, there's just good players all around. We don't have Mr. Dave Wiegand, probably one of the best Collins players in North America, but we have some of our... I mean, there's no doubt the three people we have are... They, they put a lot of work and time into this, so it's just been a matter of mm-hmm. playing the best with what they have, and it just hasn't been up to par with what needs it. Yeah, you could, they, you could argue as well that the UK is actually fielding two national champions and a future national champion. There's no doubt Lewis is going to win the national championships eventually. Yeah. yeah. I mean, he's just that good. Mm. It's just really a matter of when. So, yeah, Benji says taxiing is... He wasn't sure of it. And, yeah, that's just a weird word. I mean, it's not... Every day you would see it spelled like that, so... Not a lot of... We can't really blame you for that. It was a good effort by you. Not that I, mean, I know what you're on about, because I, I was eating. He ba- basically, Benji had a 77-point play that he missed. It was, oh, a, no. it, was a, it was a really hard find, though, so... Oh, yeah, I can imagine. No, no shame in that. Yes, he missed a, he missed a bingo, but it was a very hard Collins-only bingo. So, again, no, no shame. It's just a matter of knowing these weird words very deep into Collins' knowledge. Yeah, and that's probably something the U- the UK players have as an advantage to the Americans. Like, most of you guys would have started playing TWL first, whereas right. all of the Brits will have played yeah, cha- Chambers or Collins or whichever was the International Dictionary at the time. And I know Benji alternates between dictionaries, so sometimes it might be hard to... Yeah, be- Benji is not quite Nigel level yet. Getting there. You're fine. You're fine. What's going food. on? I'm getting food. I am. I am getting food. Just ignore me for now. I'm very <laughs> hungry. I'm walking around my house. Let's see. What should I eat? What's that? Oh no. My mum's brought me some yummy things. Oh my god, it's a donut. Oh no, yeah, jam donut. <gasps> oh. No, Benji, Benji, don't worry about it. I'm, oh, yeah. I'm, I'm just getting something oh, yeah. quick, and then I'll. I'm done, by the way. Be right back upstairs. Hey, keep the drink and the donut. Awesome. I'll eat later. Okay. I don't know if the guys have started yet. Um, hopefully they haven't. I don't believe so. Because I should have everyone on notify. I haven't seen it yet. 
Dave did message me saying like, oh, and my VAR's okay. I was like, yeah. So of course, if you guys didn't see the uh, the BMFC games at all, the Lewis and Dave matchups, you can always go over to my YouTube channel. It's all archived there. There is a panel in um, if you click on info on Twitch, there should be a panel like a whole YouTube thing. You should be able to click on that or click on the link above it. That will take you to my YouTube channel. You go in the playlist 2017 BMFC. And you should be able to find um, you should be able to find the game um, near the bottom somewhere, just before the prize giving. All right, I'm back. So it doesn't look like we've started yet, have we? No. <laughs> nope. Dave says Lewis is finishing dinner. Oh yeah, awesome, Benji. Thank you. If if my Moobot worked, you know, then I'd be able to just post the link easy peasy. But you know, Moobot's being a being a cow. That's probably the best way to describe Moobot right now. So uh, Dave says that Lewis will be a few minutes. Don't know why Lewis can't tell me himself, but oh well. I don't know. It's a interesting way of communication. Yeah. Yeah, there's no such thing as group chat on ISC unless you join one of the chat channels. And let's face it, I could make you jo you guys join any one of the number of chat channels. Uh, yeah, I'm... I'm part of a couple and they're weird. Oh yeah, definitely. I, or at least I used to be. I, I, I left them because it was too distracting for me. Yeah. Like I was saying, we should all join the Italian channel. And then oh just, yeah, that's only got six people in it. We could join the Italian channel. There's an Asian channel. Wait, really? Yeah, just type channel in the command line. You'll get the whole list. Where everything. I've is. never noticed. I've never noticed that. There's an Auss Aussie channel. It's got twenty-seven people in it. I know most of these. I mean, I know twenty newcomers or whatever. Yeah. Oh no, Max just to find Mac in Twitch chat. <laughs> so let's see. Uh, so uh, interesting things that I know about Dave Koenig. Not that I know many. He's a Yankees fan. Screw the Yankees. I hate them. For baseball? Yeah, baseball. I don't know anything about baseball. Like, I live in I live in Kansas City, and we won the World Series like a year or two ago, and I didn't even know about it until the next day when somebody asked me if I saw this amazing play, and I was like, "Twenty no, fifteen. I've never watched baseball in my life. I've never even been to a Royal. I don't think I've ever been to a Royals game. Or I have it was like a long time ago. Yeah, I'm I'm, I'm yeah. very illiterate when it comes to sports. I can't. I couldn't even name all the MLB or NFL teams or anything like that, but... I okay. usually get stuck on 29 Major League Baseball teams and then forget about the Padres. Such, I'm, such a forgettable team. I'm not ashamed to say I'm illiterate at sports. I know plenty of words to make up for. I know, I know all my one-letter words. Yeah. I did hear, though, that one way to uh, tilt Dave Koenig is to mention how Derek Jeter isn't as good a shortstop as you know as people think he is based on stats that's apparently one way to get him tilted yes Padres has a number of anagrams in Collins it has drapes Padres first rasp spaders spare and spread Oh now come on Craig, baseball isn't like cricket without hitting the ball. You just you just don't appreciate baseball enough. Okay, here we go. We're going. We're starting. 
Mm -hmm. Sorry, I just need to switch windows, guys. Re oh, oh. Sorry, that diff I've got so many scenes going on right now. Uh, yay, webcam this. reactive. We are yeah. probably going to see... Uh, I don't know if the stream sees it, but he has A-D-E-I-J-S-E-U. We're probably going to see Judy's. Yes, yep. we do. 44. Pretty straightforward. And we have another blank for the Brits. Probably going to see Gox and G-U coming down pretty quickly. Yeah, that looks pretty good. It doesn't really give back any overlaps with, uh, with the OD up there, too, which is nice. Yeah, so... It looks like we may be at a disadvantage again. You guys may take it five and one. Who knows? Yeah, so we, we do see, see that. Come down. Ar Arcadia. I imagine we'll see that. Okay. And we do. Don't yeah, you we'll mean see. we duke? Oh boy. Yeah. Even if Benji's not here, you'll still get his puns in somewhere. Oh Somehow. Boy. So, let's see. I guess options include Awoke. And Oak. But Oak isn't as good, because it allows underlaps. I imagine we'll see Awoke come down. Or 36. Keeping the best tile in the game. The G. So yeah, Awoke is looking pretty good here. Yeah. Collins has one possible way. It's not playable. Week long. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good point. Mina says she insta challenged Koenig K O N I G at the Barclay Berkeley whatever tournament two weeks ago. I don't know how you guys pronounce your American place that, names. That is. A city in California where Cesar and Mina live. Yeah, but you guys mispronounce Plymouth and Birmingham and, and Worcester. Like, Wait, the it's not pronounced Plymouth? It is pronounced Plymouth. Uh, how else do people pronounce that? I, I don't know, I thought you guys said Plymouth or something. No. And now uh, we're going to see uh, elements, elements come down yeah. for Dave. And, yeah. Aubergines. Okay. Yep. Aubergines, yep. Hello. Yep. Bonus city here. Yeah, so this is this is my kind of game. I like games full of high scoring plays and bingos. Oh, you live in Florida. Oh, well I'm very uneducated. Oh my goodness. I don't know a lot about the community. I'm not ashamed to admit that. I I know very, very little about the community because I live in I live in a state in the United States where there are only three active people. One of them is my dad and I'm one thousand grade points above him. Well, my house has more. The house I live in has more active people. That place. Yeah, it has like, it has like. No, it has four now because Alex Janikas moved here. So. Ah, uh, well, we've I, got I, me, I, my sister, my mom, my dad. Oh yeah, so you have as many people as Kansas has. <laughs> and it just in the family, if you count my uncle as well, because he played. Once oh my upon goodness. A time. Area pod. And he has drawn yeah. uh, another bingo uh, with uh, Pyranoid. Oh yeah, Pyranoid. I was looking at the M. Um, <laughs> there are so many sounds at my house. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Your house okay, is well, like my soundboard right now. Well, we see like, another I blank. I don't think obviously... we're gonna get a bonus. But we'll see R I Z probably. The word isn't it? What I believe mean? it is. It means to rise. <clears throat> Yeah, so... I think that's pretty forced here. Even even with the blank, trouble might occur. This is good. I'm liking this. He's got to play R-I-Z and hope to draw at least one and ideally two vowels. Yeah. So you guys wouldn't play something like Nerds to play off more tiles? Probably it's not. just too much of a point sacrifice. It also blocks too many bingo lanes. Oh my goodness, so many points, and... So quickly. He drew ES, so we'll see another bingo.
another bingo like I don't know, I can only see remnants. But that's just like Nortinas, I guess. Yeah. Oh, oh, Quackles just suggested something amazing. It suggests uh Is there a nine? No, it suggests in trains at L three or in Oh ISC terms twelve C. Twelve C. Twelve 12C in IS, ISC terms, making a lot of two-letter words in the process. That's a Five two-letter cool. words and some Collins two-letter words. Well, it makes one Collins two, but that's 73 points. That's nine more points than Nortinas, which is the second highest. And Lewis does need the points. Yes, he does. I could technically go check what... Dave's rack is right now because of how ISC works, but I'm not going to do that. Oh yeah, yeah, I know that trick. I like the exchange trick more. Every time somebody exchanges, you can actually work out their rack from the bag. But Wait, really? Yeah, you can. I didn't know that. Yeah, and it's technically cheating, but of course it's not because ISC just lets you do it. Oh no, wait—is it change? I think it's changing or. Yeah, I think it's it's either changing or challenged off word. Challenge off words you can do, I think. Yeah. Uh, actually, actually, I don't know. I It's been a while since I've played a game where either of those things have happened. I didn't so know either of them existed. Yeah, it's... <clears throat> yeah, so there yeah, we go. They found uh, it. Nice great, friend. Great find. I imagine we'll see... You. K6 Wump, maybe? Just dump everything, FIR isn't that bad. Both flanks are gone, but Dave took an early lead with, like, a bunch of points. I mean, you have Wump, though, W-H-U-P. Yeah, I think, I, I think playing it through the M is slightly better. Or you could play it at um, a 10B. Or K14, but I like 10B. 10B is probably a little bit better. I mean, it's five It's five points, but I guess, I guess it doesn't matter as much as I originally thought it did. Yeah, I don't, th I don't know if David's up enough to justify playing the 10B to block the E, especially with no blanks left. I think I would take the five points here and play one. Yeah. It does block the floater. Um, there is, but there is another. I don't know, e I don't know, how, I don't know how. I don't know how dangerous it is. Yeah, there is another E. I mean, it's not as good of an E, but yeah, I think especially after bingo is not so great to pull the the odds of Lewis having drawn a bingo are are slim enough that I, I would play Womp and block the Orny, and then if Lewis doesn't bingo, then think about blocking the second E next turn. Ooh, see, interesting. Maybe he doesn't know WAP. No, or he knows WAP. But I wonder I wonder if he's keeping the U for the Q. That's very There are places to play the Q on the board though, so yeah, I know. The U isn't the, like super... I think yeah, with the uh, QI by spot at fourteen F in particular. I'm that's kinda of surprising to me, but who knows? Maybe he has a reason for it. Maybe it I mean there's not even that many eyes left. Avidin and Riza, which I didn't know. Certainly did I, not know Riza. No Riza. I knew Avidin. But see, just like that, we have an eight point difference now. I mean, this game is gonna this game is gonna result in a very, very high scoring loss for whoever loses. I, I, yes. Wasn't it Dave who was involved in like a five hundred and seventy five point loss with David Eldar? David Eldar lost. I'm not sure on that. I feel like uh it was somebody. There was a very high scoring loss recently. There, but there was a very remember. high scoring loss, and I can't remember who. Um, on another he's not note, too Craig far off from, was, uh, for Kreia here. Uh, on another note, Craig Beavers suggests that Dave may have been worried about duplicating the eyes, and he has the last U for the Q, so he's probably thinking along those lines instead. But of course, we won't know until we ask him. So, yes, I. I found the game on cross tables. Um, 
Am I allowed to post links in here without getting banned? Uh, no, you have to be... Um, you have to basically be Benji or me for that. Okay, well, there's a game on cross tables, and it looks like Dave Koenig Koenig beat David Eldar 576 to 574. Wow. So it looks like we're going... I, I know from talking to people that Dave is a very... He likes to play a very open board, and he sh he's actually a very talented chess player, and he shows that in this chess play, too. I'm a chess curtain player myself. So we see yeah, far. I think that has to be correct. It's just way too many points despite the somewhat foggy CURR leave. Right. It was one off of uh, a possible for Freya, F-U-R-C-R-A-E-A, -E to the A at 01. So an interesting play here is I3 move, because apparently it takes an E and an A at the beginning of it, which I didn't know. Yeah. Oh, that's a that's a great play, actually. It scores quite a lot. And he has the case A, so it's like even better. Yeah, that's a great play. Keeps about the best leave he could ask for with that pool, too, of ASC. So apparently, guys, Chufa, C-H-U-F-A, was 44 points. Uh, oh, making F-Y. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we do see move. Yeah. That's a very that's a very strong play. Move and yeah, Chufa move. was Chufa was probably, actually, almost certainly uh, better to get rid of the, the C-U. So now he's got yeah, to deal with this. I'm still suffering from some F-Y blind blindness. I... Yeah, I, I would never have seen that because FY. Yeah. Word. So we might see J2 Kerr here and JOR. Just I actually to... didn't know JOR. Kerr I takes know an S in front doesn't though. know? Oh my goodness. Wait, S -E -R? Takes an... Yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Call it. <laughs> I yeah, do I'm know not, JOL, but not JOR. Yeah. A lot of Collins three letter words. That yeah. look like they will take an S in front will more than likely take so an now S. Now he has, front. now he has the case S too. So this play is going to be very, very tough for. Yeah, I'd say at this point it's probably advantage Lewis, even though he's down oh fifteen. He's yeah. got, oh, he did, he did draw the Q, but he's still got a pretty I, I reasonable just, rack. He has the Q bone. Oh, why? Oh, geez. Tut does block it though. This is going to be. No, he has Q I in the the bottom this right. It's going to be very down. adrenaline rushing for whoever loses. I mean, I definitely got to give the advantage to Lewis here. I mean, there's been some definitely great plays by both. I'm still kind of questioning why Whip was played or Whoop or whatever, but I mean, there's been very solid play for both players so far, so I mm -hmm. don't know what's going on. And the best part is these guys have the time left to think about the end game properly. Yeah, that's, I mean, there's absolutely. Been, they've, been, they've been going very, very fast. Dave has a fairly clunky rack here. Not many good options at all. That pool isn't necessarily, like, bad. I mean, Fob could still score L3. I mean, so I asked Championship Player, and he's already below 30% to win. I wouldn't be surprised if it was even close to that, because he, his rack is so weak. Yeah. And... Well, and, like, that's, his, and that's one option, and it's a 5k try. To block Bob, I guess, or to block whatever. But a lot of his best plays apparently here are exchanging. But it also yeah, I would consider that. exchanging here. It also probably. doesn't know that Lewis has the case S here, so that does affect things significantly. So I think we might we might be looking at another UK win here, unless something drastic happens, just because. Yeah, I mean, the problem is, even even if Dave were to exchange, and he's scoring zero, and Lewis is probably going to go up at least 30 next turn, and there's really nowhere see, for Dave to bingo or I anything. I did not see what Dave kept. Or not Dave, I mean Lewis. What Lewis kept. He kept but... A-E-E-Y-S. Which is yeah, pretty so... solid for that pool. Yeah, that's really good. He'll, at the minimum, have something like Joda and A-Y-E next turn if Dave doesn't block that. I doubt it will get blocked. Dave could potentially play something like Cry, which might actually be his best option. Championship player does not list that. It lists Cly, C-L-Y, which I didn't know. Didn't know that. That will be one of the Collins 3s again, I guess. 
Yeah, I, I told you, I don't know my Colin 3s. And neither do I. I know the 2s. I have a hard time seeing the 2s over the board, but I yes. do know those. Yes. But I, I know a few random 3s, but I haven't systematically learned them. By the way, there's some nice things being suggested in Twitch chat. Yeah, Benji is saying there. Awoken is probably a risk for both players. And of course, the E goes at L11 to make auctioned. So. Oh, I didn't mm. see that. I did not see that. So one of the interesting options, I guess, to score some points is J7 reclose, and that keeps three continents, but yeah, the N is a very key tile here, and keeping, I mean, if you can keep the E, it's even better, but I mean, you just, Dave does not have a way to play the E there for any good points. Dave almost, almost also needs to play the E, because it is his only vowel. And he's not going to really score. So he does, he does play Cly. And that's listed at exactly 20% to win per championship player. But with this rack, I feel like we're going to see Lewis just take it away here. Because, I mean, he kept R-E-L-L-T, and I don't know where that's going. So, yeah, it says Lewis is above 90% to win with some players and above 80 with like every. Yeah, he can else. even something simple like BY making YU in the bottom left corner is that's 28. That's 87.88% 8 to win. You'd be better off playing like GAY anyway. Oh, that's true, making GU. That's absolutely better. Yay! <laughs> that's only list For some reason, that's only listed at 75% to win. Really? Maybe because of the last A? I'm not sure why that's too valuable, but... I don't, I don't know either. Right. I mean, J-O-T-A is blocked now. That's kind of surprising. I yeah. mean, the best, currently the best play listed by championship player, for whatever reason I don't know, is L-10-R-E-B. I guess because that, that blocks that. Reawoke, that Actually, blocks that's Awoken. that's not a bad idea, because it's going to be very I mean, yeah, you can block for... Reawoken, but like... Yeah, I guess that is a lot more. You know, I actually it. like that because for some reason I thought it was only like twenty five, but it's yeah. I would play more. Reb saving Gay for next turn because that's it's going to be very hard for Dave to really do anything in, in the yeah, bottom left. And that's like thirty right there. I just I thought it was less for some reason, but yeah. yeah. Yeah, and the letters in the pool can't really score at all here, unless you play Foo. That's it. That's all you can really do there for points. Right. Yeah, the problem is just he has. I mean, he's just going to outrun him at this point because he has scoring tiles and they have places to go. Mm -hmm. So, we'll see what happens. Oh, it there is ready. This play, Reb. Very solid playing. It's yeah, that's 90, a great play by Lewis right above there. Above 91% to win, and it looks like we're going to see the end of Dave here. Yeah, this was a pretty unfortunate pickup for Dave here. That was, that was, these last racks just... That's that's that basically the killer draw right there. That's They're pretty the, brutal. That's been the theme here. Anybody can win these games, but it's just a matter of who draws well. And So far, I mean, the Brits have been drawing a lot of blinks. They've been playing them well. And I mean, racks like this is just, I guess, what's been the demise of it. But he played very well, given what he had. I mean, Tut, yeah. Cly, I mean, not obvious plays, but those were... No, I think I think Clyde was fine. It's just an unfortunate draw, but yeah. he really couldn't have done anything. Oh else. yeah, he, he, that's what I'm saying. He played very well given what he had. Yeah. And I he is. Only, I still think the basically only next to, to no chance here. He has. Um, don't ask. Don't ask me why, but he has a 15 percent chance if he plays two J Tell for four. Two J Tell. Plus two. Yeah. I have no I idea what the point of that is. Blocking the Y. I wonder. I wonder if it's just assuming he has a rack of A E E I O O O or something like something that he can't do anything with. I don't know exactly what that would be going for, but maybe he's going um. through like a ten through Ode. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's basically lost here, though. I mean, everything else is like seven six. Four percent to win, and he just can't score here. This is a that's just game over. I guess with Tell, he's blocking the G in the U spot, and if you if maybe if the problem is if Dave draws more consonants, leaving Lewis with vowels, Dave is going to have all consonants, not really have a spot to play them. So I'm when practice, really I mean, saying, 
way he can pull this off. I mean, I don't know what Lewis just drew, but I mean, there's three O's technically unseen. The F, the G, not the G. F-O-O-I-E and another O. But he's going to be drawing some vowels, but the problem is he's still going to have almost all one-pointers. Yeah, there's just some um, talk in the chat, because obviously it looks like the UK here are going to be first to five, and it's a best of nine. So the UK will have already won the series. Hooray for us. But uh, we're still playing all nine games. You know, see how much of a whitewash it can be. Oh, we're still going to play all nine, even if they get to five? Yeah. Because, I mean, also, like, only two of the UK players have played so far. So, that that would kind of be sad if, you know, you were that third player and you didn't get a chance to partake in your team's victory. And it looks like whatever Dave just drew was really bad. Looks like he probably drew three O's out of the bag. Ouch. Yeah, he drew O... He, he drew any three of O-O-O-I. I mean, that's just... Yep, so you know I, you're, you know you're not meant was to win. Or, well, odds are it was O-O-I, but it could have been O-O-O. And now yeah, I, so I think if Lewis just plays yeah. gay at N2 here, then the game's basically over. Yeah, game over. <laughs> yeah, so another unfortunate loss. I mean, just, just tiles aren't working out, I guess. Yeah, I mean, it's listed as a... 51.7 valuation as according to championship player. It's just not meant to... This was By the way, loss. Benji would take winning without having to show up. Yeah, I would too. To be fair. Maybe it's just me. I want to contribute. It's nice, but I still want to contribute. Well, oh well. You sound really defeated. <laughs> well, you're you're was... not even playing and you sound defeated. Well, I mean, I feel bad. I mean, it's just, it must be frustrating for Dave since he drew, he played, he drew a lot of bingos, he kept the scoring pressure on, and then he just lost because of chance. And I suppose you could argue as well, the US isn't that far behind based on the team standings, like, if you just count the spread, like, they they haven't been doing that badly. They've had the bigger win, it's just that all the games have been so close, and, and the UK just managed to edge it. <laughs> my dream tournament is one in which all 31 of my opponents get disqualified prior to the game. Yes, I would be okay yeah. with that. That would be one. That would be lovely. So what if I told you that uh, Dave actually has a win here? I'm kidding. He doesn't have a win here. <laughs> no, he. Everything here is negative valuation. He's probably his best. His best play is E M O V E in retro. <laughs> yes, we are very salty. I'm aware of that. If I am. Everyone, get I'm, out the salt emotes. They must be around somewhere. There must be like a free Twitch emote that that is salt. Do you have to pay Twitch to get more emojis? Really, I. I uh, where's there's the salt emote? There we go. I've brought out Let the it. salt. <sighs> Let's see who's playing next. Oh, Benji's brought out even more salt. Who's playing next? Um, Dave and Harshan. Yeah, Dave and Harshan. You know, I wouldn't want to make Dave tilted by asking him what he chose whip. Because he might go into another one of his rants that he did at the BMSC, yeah. and I'm just like... You know, yeah. I, I caught that on audio, he probably doesn't even realise... I, I actually had audio open at that point, but uh, yeah. that that wasn't kind of the best thing to say with me recording an audio out there. Not sure if no, anyone so, else has heard it yet, but... 
Yeah. Looking like a FES, that 14C looks right. pretty strong, saving OE at 9B to go out next turn. It does not look like Dave can go out after this. Nope. But his best play is just life's. Assuming FES gets played, I guess. I don't see why it wouldn't. Yep. There yeah, we go. Yeah. And then he also has O-R-F-E-S, which I didn't know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a good hook to off. Putting which the I didn't know. Mm -hmm. So life does take a, a Nesson Collins? Yeah, it would do. Wouldn't life's be, um, like, life sentences and things? Apparently life's, life's is now good in TWL. It's only lifer and lives. Yeah, L-I-F-E does not take any hook except an R. Oh, so it looks, there's so much salt in the chat that Mina's brought out the sugar. <laughs> so it looks like we're going to have a roughly 60 point loss here for Dave, and another win goes to the Brits. Woo! 4 and 1 plus 60. Big up the game. Brits. We're so awesome. I'm going to need people to catch up soon. That means bring out the catch up emotes. If there yeah, are any. I feel like I'm one of the only people in the world who does not like ketchup. So his best play is for five points, actually. So yeah, it's gonna be a 59 point loss. It looks like if he finds his best out. Is it O E and E A S? Yep. I was only 98 percent sure E A took an S, but I couldn't find any other five point I, plays, I so forgot E A was a word. So like, it's I can't... E E that doesn't take an S. Oh, that takes okay, an N. That takes yeah. an N. Well, the N, E-E-N is the plural of E-E. Yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> but well, I, you I'm guys might you, not I, know that. I'm showing it's... you I know a three-letter word. <laughs> Yay! So there we go. That is a 59-point loss. So it looks like the Brits take the lead again, or they build their lead. 4-1 to one plus 59. So it looks like we got to get some... you got to get a rally there. going. Even, even... Wait, is it 4 to 1? Yep. Oh, yeah. Because I was worried there, because, like, people were talking about, oh, the game might be over, and I'm like, uh... Oh, it's not, it is not over it's yet. It's not they over have... yet. The Prince must win one more game. Yeah. And then we will have our champion. Yeah. Could next be. We... And next we will have, um, Dave versus Harshan. Mm-hmm. 